Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel. And welcome if you're new. I'm Stephanie, stay at home wife, homeschooling mama to four. And we are doing a Walmart grocery pickup haul and then we do have to run into Walmart. Today I've got all the kids with me. And I will show you what we got when we get back home. All right guys, here is y'all an overview of what all we got. Lots of stuff. It's been a little since I've been grocery shopping. But <clears throat> I'm just going to go ahead and start with it. Alright. I found myself a new rug. You know, y'all know I messed my other rug up when I cleaned it. So I found myself a new one. That one was, it said $49.99, but when I paid for it, it was only $39. It's just got like some tan and mingled with the blue that's the same color as my curtains. And then I got the kittens, or <laughs> the cats, I guess you could say, because this is for Carl, too. Um, a new litter mat, because they keep getting litter. They play in the litter box and get litter all in the floor. So I'm hoping that will help catch some of the litter. All right, let's start with the grocery part. <clears throat> catch my breath. It took me a little bit to get all this unloaded and separated. All right. Let's start here. I got a, a gallon of whole milk, my vanilla caramel coffee creamer, a thing of heavy, I cannot talk, heavy whipping cream, a thing of the extra creamy whipped topping, a two pack of butter, the salted butter, and this was a substitution. I had ordered the um, Great Value chicken breast patties to make chicken sandwiches. I'm going to show y'all. I do have a menu plan this week. And, um, this they separate they substituted two of these for one pack of the other so i don't know i don't know it has in it i got one box of the cheese mini pizzas and a box of the pepperoni mini pizzas got our popsicles that really need to go in the freezer two bags of the batter mix seasoned crinkle cut fruit fries i'll do the produce in a minute then i have Popcorn chicken, our favorite popcorn chicken. And uh, one day we'll have fish fillets with french fries for, well, I don't know why I'm telling y'all. I'm going to show y'all my menu plan. Anyway, we got fish fillets, our favorite cinnamon rolls. These are awesome. Garlic breadsticks. Those are awesome. I got some more cheese tortellini. Okay. Okay, I have two packs of the boneless, skinless chicken thigh fillets. A thing of the Colby and Monterey Jack cheese sticks. Shredded mozzarella cheese. And if you hear the bags rattling in the background, y'all know what's going on. I just threw the bags on the floor. And the kittens and Carl are loving it. <laughs> Alright, where was I at? Two things of the mild country sausage. Um... The old world style black forest ham, real bacon pieces, a two pack of cream cheese, and then I have the mixed berry cream cheese spread for bagels. I have a ready crust graham pie crust, um, a thing of the yellow cake mix. Cereal this week, we didn't need a whole lot because we still have a ton left in the pantry. I got uh, Sage requested the magic treasures again. I have four things of shells and cheese, a thing of beef broth, chicken broth, my butter flavored cooking spray. Um, let's do these, so yeah. Um, mild banana pepper rings. We eat those on sandwiches and salads or whatever else. A big thing of mayo. Um, the melt and dip cheese. My husband was wanting some cheese dip with Rotel, and I already have some tortilla chips, so I'm going to make that probably tonight instead of pizza night. Alright, we have two things of honey wheat bread, two hamburger buns, a thing of the chewy chocolate chip chippers, um, a oatmeal chocolate chip cookie mix, and banana nut muffin mix, chocolate chip muffin mix. That was a substitute, too, because... Um, I had ordered the chocolate chocolate chip, but that'll be fine. We were okay with that. And my canned foods this week, all I had was the jelly cranberry sauce, sliced black olives, two things of the seasoned black beans, 
and two things of whole kernel corn. Um, we'll go ahead and do the produce now. I have a watermelon, a little tea tiny cantaloupe. I was hoping for a bigger one, but that's okay. I didn't have to go in and shop for it, so I'm all good with that. A bunch of bananas, a head of lettuce, and uh, four tomatoes on a bomb. Let's see, I'll go ahead and get these drinks down here too. I have a 12 pack of Pepsis and two 12 packs of Sundrop. These little crazy kittens, look at them y'all. Y'all are silly boys. Y'all are silly. <laughs> All right, um, the kittens needed some more food. So I got another pack of food for them. And the turtles were out of food, so I had to get them some more food. <clears throat> and I got our movie night drinks. Well, we're not going to do movie night candy tonight, and we may end up doing game night, but I'm going to make some brownies for our snack for tonight. Okay, I have two things of orange Kool-Aid, two things of blue raspberry lemonade, and two things of lemonade Kool-Aid. We couldn't, my husband's crackers, they were out of stock on them, so he asked for the cheese crackers with peanut butter, so he asked for this kind, so I got him two packs of it. Sage loves this kind, so it was a substitute. I had ordered one big huge pack, I think it was like a 20 pack, and they substituted it for three of these packs. And then Schaller, well no, we'll get to that in a minute. Let's finish up with the grocery stuff. I got two of the tortilla chip bowls for a recipe. Sage requested these. She loves these, these are really good. And she also likes these, which every one of us eat these, and we all like them. So, the cheese popcorns. And then we got the cheddar cheese stack attacks and two regular stack attacks. And then I just got the 28 single party mix a variety pack of chips. Like I said before, they don't seem to waste it as bad when I get the, the mix. And there's my expo marker over there. What is it doing in the floor? Alright, let me move these chips back out of the way. Alright, Schaller wanted some more fabric. She splits the side of her pants at the, like the, their boot cut pants, but she kind of wanted a little bit of more of a flare. So she cuts it like in a V and then replaces it with fabric, which makes it a wider leg and it gives it a little bit of style. And she's already done one leg and ran out of material, so we had to go get her another one. And she wanted this blue material too, so don't know what she's gonna do with it. We'll figure that out. She'll show us. And then Caden needed some tomato plant food, the miracle Grow. I needed, I ran out of my spray way and I miss it, but I needed some more glass cleaner, so I just grabbed this until I get some more spray way order. Uh, the girls needed body wash, so I got them a cocoa butter and shea and the cherry blossom flavor. And they also needed shampoo and conditioner, so I just got the Suave um, Avocado and Olive Oil. I got that's the conditioner, that's the shampoo. I was almost out of toothpaste, and this is the toothpaste that I like. So I got myself another one. Um, we were almost out of shaving creams, so I got two shaving creams. And this is the body wash that my husband and my son love. So I got two of those that were almost out. And my wash and detergent, which is just the original gain liquid. And I think that's about it. Yeah. And um, I'll show y'all the little gift Walmart gave me in my grocery pickup. When we got home, I found this in my trunk. And you know how Walmart pickup, they usually just give you like a little gift bag every now and then. But inside of it, it has a package of the Parmesan Whisk cheese crackers, a thing of the Glad Flex and Seal quart storage zipper bags, a sample of Tide, a Power Pod, and oh, here's one more the Liquid IV. I think it's, yeah, it's watermelon flavor. And then just like some, you know, they always put like little brochures and stuff. I don't know. They may have coupons in them. I don't know. I'll check it out later. And my son also got three big bags of potting mix because he made himself and myself, because I asked for him to, some planters to put our tomato plants and stuff in. So, 
Now I'm gonna show y'all my menu plan for the week. Before I show you my menu plan, um, I forgot about the ice cream. I went ahead and stuck it in the freezer. So I got one thing of homemade vanilla ice cream and two things of the chocolate chip cookie dough. Now for the menu plan. Here is the menu plan. All right, Sunday. I always start my menus on Sundays. So Sunday breakfast is our cinnamon rolls. Lunch will be chicken stuffing, green beans, potatoes, and rolls. Don't really know if we're going to get to have this because I forgot we were supposed to go to my grandmother's this Sunday. So, I think we're having hamburgers and hot dogs there. So, that may be moved to next week. Alright, then for supper we'll have sloppy joes and french fries. And dessert will be cupcakes. Monday, um, the kids have Bible school next week. So, I try to make some, um, some easy breakfast because... <laughs> this crazy cat. He's playing in a Mountain Dew box now. Anyways, uh, their Bible school um, at the church that they're going to, it starts at 8.45 in the morning. So, they're going to have to get up really early so they're going to go feed their critters. But I just had simple breakfast this week. So, for breakfast on Monday, and it goes all through the week, the Bible school does. They're going to have cereal for breakfast. Lunch, it lasts until 11.30, so they will be here for lunch. So, lunch will be pizza and chips. Supper that night, I'm going to do beans, potatoes, mac and cheese, and cornbread. And then for dessert, we'll have a pie. I don't know what kind I'll fix yet, but we'll come up with something. Okay, Tuesday, another easy breakfast will be muffins. You see all seen the muffin mix that I had. Lunch will be the popcorn chicken and mac and cheese. For supper, I'll just use the beans that I had cooked because I always have leftover beans for chili. And I'll make some cornbread. And then dessert will be banana pudding. Wednesday, breakfast will be sausage and biscuits. Lunch will be sandwiches and chips. Supper, I'm going to do a white chicken chili crock pot. Oh, I didn't think. I'm going to have two chilies there. <laughs> we may have to swap some stuff up. Y'all probably see it during the week, so I'll probably swap this up with something. But dessert will be cookies. And then Thursday, I'll make some uh, egg and cheese McMuffins. I have like just like the little English muffins, so I'll make that. Uh, lunch will be leftovers or ramen noodles. Supper will be deer tenderloin, potatoes, mac and cheese, green beans, gravy, and biscuits. Dessert will be a cheesecake. That's what I got the graham cracker uh, pie crust for. Friday, breakfast will be oatmeal. Lunch will be the fish. You all saw the fish fillets, fish fillets and fries. And supper will be pizza and movie night. Dessert will be brownies. We usually have almost the same thing for supper and dessert on Friday nights, so that's probably not going to change. <laughs> okay, anyway, Saturday we'll be having a big breakfast. Lunch will be chicken sandwiches and chips. Y'all saw the chicken patties that I had. Supper, I'm going to do the tortellini bake and breadsticks. And then dessert, I'm going to do a cherry dump cake. Alright y'all, that's going to be it for my video today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. I will really appreciate it. And that is what our family will be eating this week. And we are a family of six. Four kids, my husband and I, and myself. And uh, if you enjoyed the video and you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We would love to have you join our YouTube family. And hit the bell notification beside of it. It will let you know when I upload a new video. And thank y'all so much for watching. And until next time, bye.